Hello. It's me, Di Marino. Welcome to Stream Part Two of BTTCTTTTCCCCC Dragons in Toka. Do touring cars. Hope that we're well, ladies and gentlemen. Gonna hide the uh, hide the baby for ah oh, fuck it it's gonna happen baby face beard is gone I'm young young and killer and we're gonna pick up where we left off yesterday at Croft basically basically I I <laughs> I was getting bored of the beard. I know, right? I just look like 800 years younger. The campaign continues here at Croft for round 13 and The hippie's 14. still here. And I think it would be fair to say we are in for a wet weekend's racing. It is absolutely bucketing down out there and there is a lot of water on the track. <laughs> Using new pedals, no. Pretty much, Rocket, pretty much. Didn't even ask us. <laughs> I know, well, I was eating earlier and, like, beard got in my food and I was like, this is the last straw. I, I don't have any sort of... Okay, well, the story is I went to go shave with my sort of, like, my trimmer to sort of keep a bit of beard and then the trimmer broke halfway through, so I had, like, this much beard left. Just, like, really big bushy and this sort was sort of, like, trim, so I had to just clean shave it all. But there you go. Anyway, qualifying in the rain at Croft. 50 years. Um, I don't really... Um, I don't really... I know Croft okay, not in BTCCCCC though. And so, so I have no idea how we're gonna do. Hopefully the controls work. Qualifying session about to start. Let's hold our breath and watch some of the action. The Croft time. Their controls are as I remembered. Uh, T1. It's like this. And there's a weird chicane. There's a right, which continues round. And there's a chicane up here as well. This is my first time ever driving this track in this game, by the way. I never got this far as a youngster. I always got booted out of the championship by, uh, before Donington. There's a sort of weird right. Oh, my gears aren't set properly. It's reset my setup, the bastards. No, it's raining. And we're round. There goes the pole position. How food for later. Yeah, I know, right? Also, the car is a lot slower with the, with the shorter gears. It's really weird. And then this is the braking bit here. Yep, yep. Round we go. And this keeps going, and then it turns into a left, then a right, then a hairpin, I think. I'm not regular cross. I don't drive here often. Actually, a really fun track in a front wheel drive car when you get it right. Bailey and I used to drive around here in a BTCC mod, and he used to pump me a lot. It was scary. Yeah, sunny in and sunny out. Learn to love him just the same. With all the driver's laps completed, let's take a look at the final grid positions for the race. I mean, that, that's, so that's, uh... The session, strolling away with another pole is Nissan Hotshot, Anthony Reid. I'm like, that's not that, not just racist horse, but it's also incorrect. <laughs> what would you expect? So that lap like puts yourself. the newcomer right in the thick of Temp. the start. Not so bad. Not so bad. Despite a spin. I need to go and change my, uh, my gearing. His long gearing is best gearing. You actually go fast. Okay, so this is my first race ever at Croft. We've got four laps in the rain against the AI, who seem to be getting better. They seem to be... I feel like they're improving as the season goes on. That might just be me, though. But no, no Volvo frets. Just about see us there behind the, uh, the Renault. The way we go. A Persia, there's a pug there, did pretty well. Qualified in 8th, and of course, 
Please, come back. I am sorry. Arby's going nuts. Arby's going very... Arby, get out of the way, lad. Oh, hoy! Oh, my God! Every time we out fell... Oh, the, 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 vo the voxel there took the, uh, the, the right route. There's a Peugeot off to the left. Oh, fourth gear is too long. We fucked it, boys. Yeah, Tiff, Tiff Nadell is the one he did the commentary on this and on, on the uh, first Toka game as well. Oh my god, how am I meant to do that corner? The car just spins. That's my second time through there. Twice I've spun now. I know, NASCAR, I know. It had to go. It was getting in my food. It was pretty disgusting. It will come back though in time. My, my hair goes pretty quickly. I'm really not feeling very fast around here at all. Well, oversteer wouldn't be too bad if you could correct it in the front wheel drive way by jamming on the throttle, but that doesn't really work in this game. Yeah, we're catching up to the back again. We've got a couple of laps to do this though, so I've got to try and get on with it. Nothing goes right when you show. Now, next time, I mean, I'm probably going to have some money because the reason why I had to shave it is because my trimmer broke. I had to sort of just completely kill it all, so I'll probably buy a new one when I have the money to do so. Fourth gear is so long. I'm going to break. Oh, dead, Harvey. I'm going to try and just copy the AI cars through here. See what they do. I just go very slow through there, it seems. Side by side with the bin. Thank you. Oh! <laughs> with the, the handling in uh, Poker 2, like, it's very strange going through these fast corners. inside of Radisic. I'm so happy that I can say that properly now. Thank you to whoever who uh, spelled that out for me, the way to say Radish and Itch. I can now like say it. I could never say it before yesterday, so thank you to whoever that was. I forget who it was. Fifty bucks. <laughs> A lot of money, but nice, man. Thanks, Steve. Immediately bins it at T1. Fuck me. Oh, I'm going to have to hope the feature is better than this because I'm not going to score points now. Although one of the fours has gone off. It being in the rain really doesn't help either. I can't, I can't do, I can't restart these. Good. Driving to the back of the field intensifies. You're on two points. No, I'm on totally top ten of points. But I'm on five outside the points right now. I'm a long way off the points, which I need to score because like I'm... I'm third in the championship, and I'm sort of within a, in a chance of winning it at the moment, anyway. I won't be if I continue like this. Yes, it's a good game, Sim UK. It's, uh, controls haven't aged well at all, but it's still a fun game. Without a doubt, the controls are the most frustrating part of this experience. Well, unless there are some sort of punts up ahead, we aren't going to be improving our position at all. You can always hope for punts, though. I'm going to have to break there mid-corner, because 
Warwick. Warwick is dying at the back, as he should be. We can hope to catch these guys in front, though. I don't understand it. I can't do it. I can't do that corner. Man, we are going to have a horrid time in that feature race. Absolutely horrid time. This plus more laps. Not looking forward to it. I'll also do this in the cockpit the rest of the race. There you go. Windscreen has been got rid of. The extra lighting, lightning, lighting in the cockpit. Oh, that frame rate is glorious. Too much work and now putting into the wheel with a bloody pad. I just shorten that fourth gear. <laughs> I don't know what would help. I don't know how the, the game works really. Let's take oh no, and Rydell won as well. well Menu didn't race behind us and place that high, which is okay, four. but Rydell is Rydell. the championship leader right now. He just pulled 15 points on me. Well, it certainly wasn't the newcomer's day today, and he'll be very disappointed with that result. He is, trust. Um, let's give it a go and see what it does. Worst case scenario, we're worse. Cloudy though for race two, so we have a bit of rip at least. Position for the feature race has to be decided now. So let's join the drivers on their second one shot qualifying lap. Oh my god, we're off already. Rats. Come on. <laughs> oh, okay, it didn't spin. right lap so far one more corner come on look at that not a bad lap actually that hopefully will be a top five Drivers' laps completed. Let's take a look at the final grid positions for the race. Another scorching lap means the new Volvo driver will start. Well, we score one point in the least. Right there, down in eighth. That is good for us. You have to score as many points as possible over him. Another clean lap. Well, some people are new to the the chat, Jacob. Some people won't know. Scorching. Time for the Volvo fret. The ah, wrist is doing that thing where it locks up sometimes, and you have to just. There you go. Crack it. Volvo so frets. There they are. Breaks in the cloud now as conditions improve for today's feature race. With the media reporting a possible ousting from the team, the newcomer really needs to get. Gonna take my fucking lunch again. Today. Watch me get punted. Again. Every time. Killed at 2-1. Also 
something was different. Oh my god! Well, I got completely AI'd there and it started raining. Feel when the tires do not work. Well, here we go again, lads. At the back, fucking hell! Why did it? Why did it just like drop straight away? Why does the rain start straight away? It's so damn you, code masters! I can't. I have to do one more lap before the pit window opens. And the rain stops. What the fuck? Game, please. Put a midfielder. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Yeah, it does like dry off straight away. We're in 13th somehow, so I guess it all isn't lost. Fourteen seconds faster than my split last lap, not bad. And it's starting to rain again! And then instant wet. It's instantly wet. I can't do anything about it. Oh my god. I turned the corner, I instantly had nowhere near as much script as I usually have. I don't think it's that advanced corrupt. I'll take Inters anyway, because they're the best of the shout, and I can't drive otherwise. Menu is last. Mm. Thing is, with the AI, from what I know, it doesn't. The rain doesn't really affect them, like how, the same way it affects me. quite frustrating I'm not gonna lie I can't wait for buddy this game I can't I can't wait for Croft to be over <laughs> I knew it was gonna be difficult as soon as I got into it no way back from this now
Doesn't help the controls got so damn sensitive. I have no idea, Robert. I've not tested it. I think Sam knows the reason why, yeah. That's that's hundred percent accurate, Sam. Best line. Why risk turning when you can straight line that shit? I made it! We got round in one piece! Okay, man, that's right, here we are. Sucking at Croft. I mean, really sucking at Croft as well. Well, just a little bit. We're catching some people, which is something, I suppose. And Cullen's a minute behind. Well, Cullen. We are going to have one point from this weekend. That's right. We've got pole into the feature, so that's the point at least. No, I try to give it... Uh, I try to? I aim to give it a go in a bit, Graham. Not a bit, I think. I'll try and do it on these pedals as they are, but they're pretty knackered right now. Oh my god, okay, well I'm staying out. Fucking rain's trolling me to the max. We're catching some people, that's something. Out of the way, I ain't waiting for you. Fucking punt. I was bad through there. <laughs> Menu's just in front. But I don't know how close we are to the rest of the field. I'm going to assume not very. The car ahead has already made their Don't spin! I just can't. It happens so randomly. And I can't do anything about it apart from wait and then get frustrated. But now it's gripping fine, but then sometimes it's like, now nah, I'm going to spin now. Nothing you can do about it. Badly. Somehow. 
I'm being as gentle as I can be, that's the thing. Like, you should see how quick I'm being with the input to turn left and right. Or Bedelli's car. Yeah, there is that. Catch menu. I don't know, man. We'll see. I don't think we will. We are on intermediates as well on the right track. We're fast through this part of the course. But everywhere else, we're just shit. I know right you told me that. And this is uh, this is Croft. Very oh, please. Where is the Swedish bias? I can see points. Oh, there are the points. Go, go, go. Yeah, uh, me too. I hate this bloody track on this game as well. Randomly spinning for no reason at every corner. That's what Toker is. It's sort of weird coming back to this game after such a long time. Obviously you have a you have nice feelings of it and nice emotions tied to it, but driving it again, like, God it's bad. <laughs> God it's bad now. Yeah, I'm, I'm not even. I'm just aiming to try and get around the bloody corner on this thing. That's the difficulty. I can't get around the fucking corner. Angry! Oh, well, we'll do an onboard lap in this fucking weird view. Oh, she's, oh, she's driving this view. A long time ago, I did I did uh, a red race to type four of one of the teams on like the hardest mode I could do basically. Feel we almost do a clean lap on the onboard view. Well, that sucked. Bloody Croft. I'm right out. The score's yet and more points over for me. Great race. It's the first win of the year for James Thompson. But how bad are we now? And there are the Look at that. Jesus Christ. Standing. We were third at the, coming into this round. Now we're down seventh. Damn it. But well, we're still winning though, Constructor's still winning, which is good.
We're still winning constructors. Being carried by Rydell right now. Please say we're someone better, somewhere better this time. Where are we now? That's a turn. That looks easy. But actually, that corner going into that will be annoying. Any sweeping corners in this game are awful. Still a lot of this track, basically. Welcome to the annual touring car visit to Norfolk and the exciting Snetterton circuit. Um, I do stuff on Fridays usually, which I need to actually sort out. Today. It's lovely and sunny with not a cloud in sight. Best weather. And so with the first high-octane, thrill-packed qualifying session about to start, let's hold our breath and watch some of the action. Don't spin. Oh my god, I wanted to spin straight away there. So touchy. Stop it, stop it. How can I do that? Tell I'm going to speed through there. A mile call like this and the car spins. Strats. Strats. Oi. Deep out again. I might well do. Let's see a rundown of the qualifying hey Barry. times. And once again, the new Volvo driver sees off the opposition to take pole. I'll take that. Nice, fair pole position there. I've got to win like every race now if I want to win the championship. The drivers are ready then for the start of the sprint race. So let's join. Yeah, I'm the yellow and truly the PTCC. Oh, that's bad. Ah, uh, we're going off. Let's change control just for the race. That'd be a good idea. Nah. Ah! Oh! <laughs> the most annoying crash. Friend. Restart reflex here. Yeah. Okay. We can come back from this. Even if it means employing strats. Hey boys, we back. I'm not coming last again. Fucking radish. Well, dear.
I actually tried to take it that time, went in far too quickly, so go GG me. Use that Volvo speed. Oh, V6 white. They're overtaking. We're in the points. Actually, screwing points is going to become a meme soon. Oh, whatever. Fuck it. I don't even care right now. This is cheating. This is what this is. That's you looking for the pump. It's alright. I'll get. They'll be calmer soon. Don't worry. I'll, I'll be killed or I'll spin or something. What, what? One of the Renaults is on the grass for no reason. No one's there to stop me, damn it! Oh no! Karma! Want the Silverstone difficulty back? That was easy. Hey boys. Get out of it. Hey Julian. Welcome to Temp. You scoring a point? Two points. I just get so frustrated because as soon as you get in the grass, you just get killed. The speed goes straight away. Gotta go for the hacks now. Gotta go for the top hacks. Points, please. Come on. Points. More points. One more. One more. Here's how the race finished. <laughs> well, another race over and another great win for James Thompson. So the new Volvo driver crosses the line in the points, but he may be slightly disappointed with that position. Anything could happen here today with the new rules adding tension and drama to the day's qualifying sessions. I love tension and drama. Why can't I drive like this in the race?
No strats, but I need the strats, Joe. I come last otherwise. These are, I lessened the strats. They were like <laughs> watered down strats there. So let's take a look at the full. And once again, the new Volvo driver sees off the opposition to take pole. Really, boys? I'm getting like two points for ra uh, 30 rounds, just getting pole each time. So as we move on, the Volvo frets are back. The sunshine remains, making conditions for the feature race very much the same as they were for the sprint race. After a ticking off from the team boss, the newcomer will really feel under pressure to do well here today. I'm gonna, what's, what, I'm gonna get punted in T1 or spin at T1 or somewhere else and just go back to last every race without fail. Not dead! Right now, please. Oh! Controls. Drats! Almost smooth through there, and then we. <laughs> Fair overtaking! I even took the right line through there! We're leading a lap! Ah, run away! It's ready. Come in when you're ready. Ah, Disco, Disco, why? Fucking Disco. So distracting. Thank you. Lock them up, boys. Disco stop. <laughs> Taking the intended route for the circuit. Ugh. Boring. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the boys. I was gonna have him as A boys. He's our like our uh, he's our character that we use for these things. But you can't put a uh, a punctuation mark between the uh, full name and surname. So it'll just be A boys. We need to win this. Like we need to win. The other cars are starting to we can't come anywhere else. If you want to have any chance of a championship, we have to win, and that isn't going to help. Fuck! 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 Hey, fuck! Fuck! Fucking bugger! It's so important to win, says Jimmy. Spins at the next corner because he can't fucking hit the brakes. He's a bell end. Let's put in this lap. Fuck it. Let's get in.
Welcome to Jimmy Swears at Tucker for 10 hours. <laughs> oh shit, I just screwed over right now! I just screwed over right now, he came in! That's actually good for our championship. I'm not too upset about that. Stop fucking around, I'm just saying, I'm trying, Julian! Stop fucking around, I just suck. Rip Rydell's race. Not even mad though. Actually breaking for that corner. That's a meme. Also, guys, I didn't really discover this, but uh, Mr. Aero HD in chat has like a really big channel on YouTube. I didn't know. He's got like 25,000 subscribers and. Also streams on Twitch, so go check him out. He does a lot of cool stuff like this. He's a bit better than I am, though. Uh, strats. He's a bit better at these, uh, these sort of games. I sort of suck. And it's humorous because I suck. I know. Break so mean. Oh, stop it. <laughs> Don't you be flattering me. He was, he was streaming... What were you streaming yesterday? Some, uh, it wasn't flat out. It wasn't called that. Test drive... Total Destruction? Is that what it's called? I don't know. It's some game I've never heard of before. It looked hilarious as fuck. That's Ricard. Breaks. Driven to destruction. I, I I I nearly got it. I nearly got it right. I got the destruction bit right. Damn kids in your games! I can't keep track. That's what happens when I take the chicane. I'll do badly through there. Oh, record speed run. Right. Well, record, boys. It's coming. There are people who speed run Need for Speed, so I wouldn't be as surprised if people speed run this. I never understood speed running a racing game, though, because, like. I don't know. It just doesn't seem like it's something you could do. Aside from, like, I don't know, Mario Kart is sort of like the limit for me, or like the Diddy Kart thing that people do. But I, I could never see us. I could never see you run something like this. I would just get bored of it. Let's go and race in the sim instead. Hey. <laughs> Easy DQ. No, they they all have a weird like cadence to their voice. It's like the speed run cadence. I'll try and try and do it. You want me uh gonna come for the chicane now and uh. This is the best sort of strat for this area and it was discovered by me and another guy and I'm doing it badly. Strat. Thing is though, if that if that if it were a speed one, you would just do that. Every chance you to cut any time off, you just cut the course like a motherfucker. This is actually speedrun practice. Pretty much Sam Car. So I attempt to speedrun games all the time. It's really bad. Come on, Rickard, give it up. If you sh should have given it up, Rickard. And now look what you've done. You pillock.
Eye for an eye. Killing right now. I'm just drawn to it. Just drawn to merging with teammate. Like a compulsion at this point. <laughs> no, dude, I cannot. I, Jimmy Broadbent, cannot go one race without twatting Ricard Rydell. And that's the truth. Here we are again. I'm, I'm gonna wait this time. I'm gonna wait. I'm using the fucking brake. Rickard! Rickard! <laughs> you little shit, get out of the way! The car ahead is not pitted yet. So you fucking get. Are you still there? No, 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 Boy, we winning. Three laps to go, repeat. Three laps to go. Going well, keep it steady. <laughs> My engineer is so fucking on edge, like, please just don't crash. The boost, there is no boost. This is the boost. I don't dare go on board. I can barely do it, buddy, on this camera. Motics, please. Also, guys, I, 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 10, 8, 50 subs. It'd be cool to get this stream, just saying. So if you're enjoying me being absolutely fucking atrocious at Toka 2, make sure to that subscribe button. Then I legally I own your soul. And you don't need that soul anyway, just you know, just raise you down. Who needs conscience and morals? Not I! As demonstrated by my treatment of Ricard Rydell. I mean, <laughs> my face is new, I know. Ah! My face is the result of when I actually go into the uh, cabinet in my bathroom. What does this thing do? I mean, I could put the webcam on for my feet. Actually, no, I couldn't, it's not plugged in. But um, it's not even on the pedals right now. Yeah. We'll just be seeing pedals. Maybe I can say like I'm using it, using psychic ability. Tony Narrow Straight. <laughs> Final lap. Repeat this. 
It's not factor two. <laughs> Actually, my favorite joke so far, the RF2 jokes about this. The RF2 is great. <laughs> Didn't know the RF2 had the S40. Is there a chance that we might win this race? We've got seven seconds on menu. All we have to do is not spin. Proceeds to spin at the next corner. Well, I'm now. Easy. Easy there. Okay, good. We're through. I'll even take the last chicane properly. The end of the stream music is running in the 80s by Magnavox. I'm looking to get a new track soon. Cool, but I'd rather have something original for it. No, 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 no. No, 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 come on! He's there! He's there! Go, 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 go! Come on, you piece of shit! Come on! Come on. <laughs> okay, we're gonna be alright. Well, gotta make sure it's interesting at the end. Gotta entertain the viewers. <laughs> Let's take a look then at the final positions. And another feature race victory for the newcomer. Volvo must be delighted with his progress. It's somehow so winner. <laughs> Great job, you did really well. Menu is going to be leading championship now, I think. Because uh, Rydell didn't score very well. I don't know why that was. And there are the current now we're six. God, we're, and we're so far off Rydell. This stage is Sweden's Rickard Rydell. Where are we next? I know I can double win Silverstone if I don't fuck up, so that's 30 points. Anyway, the standings, because you can't see all of them right now, the standings are... Uh, we have Rydell, top. Um, words. Rydell, top with 148. Anthony Reid on the 130. Alain Menu 124, James Thompson 122, he's had a bit of a late season charge. Dave Lesley on 121, so there's only uh, three points between third and fifth, and then me in sixth on 116, Plato seventh. And then the Peugeots, <laughs> seven points between them. Revolver still leading the standings though, best constructor. Luna! I wonder what that does. Yes, I do want to do that. <laughs> Poor Radish, man. Oh, back to Fraxton. This didn't go well the first time. Welcome back for our what the fuck? To Thruxton really? For 17 and 18 of the season. The weather could be a major factor here today. What the, with what's that? Threatening rain at any moment. Yeah, I, I don't know the JCL cockpit. No. Qualifying I can't see. Race is just about to start, so let's join the action and see who dares to push their car closest to the limit. I literally can't see. Oh, what the? This is. A, oh my god! Well, there's fog, and then there's just no draw distance. I can't remember where the far stuff is. I have to really concentrate here. Here somewhere.
Surely not. With all the driver's laps completed, let's take a look at the final... <laughs> Accurate British graphics. So okay, not quite a poll, but close, that's not bad. And heading the grid for the first time this year is Renault's Jason Plato. And that's a great drive by the new Volvo driver. He'll be happy with his place on the second row of the grid. Having to actually use the... I'm, the thing is, I'm actually having to use the braking markers. I'm actually driving properly. <laughs> I'm not driving like a tool instead. Drivers are on the grid and the lights are about to come on. Let's see who gets away in the lead. <laughs> Time to go right there again. We get away. And menu has been lost to the no, plate has been lost to the fog. There comes Rydell. There goes menu. Just let him pass. But they'll just bash out of the way. Together, right down, right down, no, please, no, right down, I'm sorry. Okay, right down, I'm sorry, no. <laughs> I'm so scared of him. Holy shit, we're leading, boys. Leading the fog. Actually paying attention to where the trap's going, because I can only see... Well, you can, you can see what I can see, so... There's absolutely fuck all at this point. We need <laughs> Holy shit, we leading. A lap led lead. What's it like in the cockpit view? Oh I don't wanna look man. I'll wait till I get to like a straight of some sort. We can do it here because corner's fairly sick. Oh my Jesus Christ. I mean this I can't I can't see where we're going there. <laughs> it's just grey, just driving. Completely from memory. Where's, where's church? Here? Yep, ish. I mean... Okay. Through your pits. Still leading. Jesus Christ. We we really we need to double win here, we do. If we're gonna be in contention in the championship still. I mean, this is so disorientating. No, this is this is the first time we've come across this sort of fog this season. Control, stop it. <laughs> Joe, please. 
it's just it's a reflex when you're streaming to look at chat and it's like i could look at chat maybe i should put my attention to trying to bloody navigate around this half blind oval in before it rains as well for no reason Controls Y. Well, I know that sort of thing looks really super stupid, like from when you're watching, but like, that is me trying to turn left a little bit to try and, and not run off to the, the grass on the right, and the car just snaps. Like the controls go right, okay, maximum, and then you die. Holy shit, we went and run it. Went and run it? We, we run to win. We ran to win. We won! Yeah! Somehow. So, let's see the final result. Victory again for the newcomer, and he's really mixing it with the pros now. Mixing it with the pros. Best punts. Ready for, ready for the, uh, the clapping. The feel when you can't see the crowd because of the fog, and you mow them down. Look at this guy on the, just to the left with the, the, the weird sort of dangling from around his neck. It's getting battered around by the... Uh... It's crunch time again as we join you know, the you know it, Ryan. showdown qualifying session. new DLC. No, I've not got any of the DLC for Forza Horizon 3. What is it? Is it some sort of good thing? I can't really afford to spend any money right now, that sort of shit, because I just spent a million billion pounds on my new wheel. Which, by the way, that wheel is now somewhere in Belgium. I've been tracking it on the thing. <laughs> Still alive! Hot Wheels DLC. Best sim for the horizon. Ultimate are later Swedish breaking the technique. Bork bork. Let's see a rundown of the qualifying times. So with all the drivers laps. Well, the boys were in fourth. Pole position for Anthony Reed. A great lap from the new Volvo driver. Lapping spa. He'll start on the second row. Excuse me. I'm really looking forward to getting the rig set up. Like, we're going to have a proper... I don't know, I'm probably going to have a stream when I first get all the stuff set up and just stream my first impressions. Or I might record it. I don't know, one or the other. We'll, we'll see. No the Volvo frets. play a part today as conditions for the feature race remain unsettled. So watch for the lights <laughs> Wouldn't that, yeah. the start of the feature race. Luckily he's on the right, so we're sort of okay. I mean, that, that, that's the chatterbait thing right there. Give me rub snipples for 10 hours whilst looking at you, Will. Donate to make me stop. <laughs> I 
Oh, Leslie. Out of the way, you. The boys are coming through. Now, ideally, we need to kill Rydell. For our personal championship. Cool. I mean, go right. Oh, dude, don't flash that. I can't see anything as it is. It's like they can't see. Let's flash some fucking text over the screen as well. Too fast for you. The wheel have I bought? Well, that's a secret. There's a secret. A lot of people know. But if you do know, I'd ask you not to let it slip in chat. We want to have some sort of surprise. That tall gear in though. Yeah, it, it, it's it's a secret to the channel, but not to the Discord. Does that makes sense. Like that, that's what I meant. I'm really bad at keeping secrets on Discord. I'm just excited to someone talk about it. Riley Cross is best cross. I can see pretty well here. I'm so glad they put breaking markers in this game because if I didn't, I would just die. Switch it over. We remote. <laughs> I might have a fucking Huskinvale GT rig. The the pro pedals and then a fucking Wii <laughs> Wii steering wheel remote thing from Mario Kart. Hey guys, it's Jimmy here and today I'm gonna be revealing my new my new wheel. Now the force feedback isn't quite what I expected. But the design overall is very not, very compact. And and just overall very white and pla and plastic and also I haven't got a Wii. <laughs> I've got a fly stick somewhere. That's like my over the top YouTuber, although I guess that sometimes the videos when I do introductions sound a bit over the top. Oh no! Oh, 
Time to pit for new tyres, boys. Daniel, I'm sorry, don't give me the ellipsis. It's starting to make you sad. But we're still leading. Ah, Thompson, why? Yeah, it's a pre a pre win donut. They're quite popular in BTCC. Obviously you guys don't watch it. Otherwise you'd know that. Well, I was technically correct when I said it, Brandon. That's kind of correct. Luckily, around here, um, the AI it seems to be limited to the stock gearing of 137 miles an hour. So whenever there's a straight, I just pull away. Which is why, like, I'm, I'm so easy for me to take lead again, despite sort of making those silly mistakes. No, <laughs> You're just getting up super early for it. It's like, right, I'm going to get up Sunday, make, wait, I'm going to get up Saturday, make sure I'm awake for Sunday. <laughs> can't, can't, I mean, don't have to wake up if you don't fall asleep. There you go. That's me trying to do a meme. I did a meme, ladies and gentlemen. My brain isn't quite processing very well. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> My brain isn't processing too well right now because uh, of this fucking draw distance. Ah, oh, free wise, free wide withdrew. It's only a matter of time. Also, guys, I guess I'll run this past you lot, because whilst I am, um, I like the idea of keeping secrets and planning things. I also like the idea of getting good feedback. So next year for VEC, it's looking very lucky. Like I'm actually going to drive again. Um. Maybe part of DNS, but maybe part of a different car where we try and recruit other YouTubers and have like a YouTube car and have the whole experience. Because, like, my idea was to try and experience or document as much as we can of the DNS season, but have it done, you know, by channels who are going to edit the videos, upload, etc., make them look nice and fancy. I have like a whole YouTube team, but I, I don't know who we'd ask. Obviously, I would love to ask uh, Matt Orr, but I don't think the races fit his schedule. I don't remember asking him before. Um, but I want to know what you guys think of that idea. Yeah, Joe, don't worry, Joe. Like I said, it's, it's in the, the idea is in development, Joe, don't worry. It's an idea at this point, of course. Nothing is set in stone. That's good, that's good, that's good feedback, though, Sam. That's good to know, man. I like a chat when doing this. I would like to get Reese on it, but Reese already drives Magenta. Reese is a Magenta driver. Also drives a glorious nip on the limousine. Which drives BTCC. I mean, the inputs I'm putting in are quite, you know, pretty accurate for that sort of thing. But that's that's good feedback, though, guys, because obviously, like, we only have our sort of minds together for that, and there's not good feedback. But we can always do something else.
Holy shit, we're zapping people. What's that? This is the final lap. What? That's what I heard there. Oh no, that. This is your time to crash. Okay. Blue flag. That's how we deal with fucking lap traffic in the Volvo. Yeah, I know. Uh, there is a lot of be uh, bullshit when it comes to driving uh, BEC, but I don't know. Like, I sort of like being a part of it still. I mean, maybe we'll just do it more casually. I don't know how we how we'll approach it, but Oh God, pardon please. Best line into the last chicane. Double win boys. Even with, uh, even with the dead at the end there. Here's a rundown of the final placings. Another well-deserved victory for the newcomer there, and he's really starting to notch up some impressive results. I mean, that is well-deserved, let's be honest. Where did Rydell finish? Fifth. Okay, that's good. More points. I think I get you. I think I get you back. Fair victory there. So let's see how today's results affected the championship. Okay, so we're back in the, the hunt. Right out on 160 points, Reed on 151. We're third now. We were seventh at one point with 146. James Thompson 142. Alan Menu 133. Leslie on 129. And Plato with 126. Hmm. Ow. Volvo stomping though, Volvo 306 points now on this hand, 280, Renault 260, then Honda being carried by Thompson pretty much on 181, Vauxhall 95, Audi 44, sucks, suck, <laughs> Mondeo, the Ford 33, and Peugeot on 7 points for the season. What? At the end, there's more. There's more rounds. No, no, I could have won. No, You little bastards. All right, Sam.
Do I have to do it all again? 